guys, I'm kind of tweaking right now, and it's like 8.30 in the morning, <laughs> and I'm, okay, hey, hey, I'm kind of tweaking right now, and I just went live on TikTok because I just had a full-blown breakdown because TikTok is gonna get banned, question mark, and I decided that I'm gonna do a Bella Hadid makeup tutorial, so let's do it. I haven't washed my hair in four days, okay. <laughs> I didn't even position the camera at all. Oh, that's my Rolling Stones poster. Should we do a wall tour? No, I don't want to. Okay. Hey! A lot just happened. TikTok just like shut down for 45 minutes. And I lost my mind. I lost my mind. But it's okay. Everything's fine now. It was just a glitch. I showered for the first time in a while. Anyway, today I'm gonna be doing a Bella Hadid look. So let's go ahead and I'm gonna Mario, what's his name? Miss Ari Ariel who does um, Kylie Jenner's makeup and Makeup by Mario. I am feeling this fantasy today. I'm gonna use these these alligator clips, girl. Anyway, I was watching a couple different tutorials on how to achieve the Bella Hadid look and basically it's just and then you pull your face up like that. So I'm going to completely change the structure and shape of my face to fit Eurocentric beauty standards because I'm mentally ill. So I'm gonna start with a concealer that's way lighter than what I should be using because it's all I have. And she does a very dewy, dewy look. So I have this, was sent to me for free. Don't really know what it is. Soft focus glow drops. Can you guys see me? Wow, okay. Watch this give me a rash. I'm allergic to every single beauty product that's ever been out on the market except for chapstick. But I think chapstick makes you addicted. I think it dries your lips out. That's why I don't use it, I eat it. Oh girl, I'm feeling this fantasy. Little greasy monkey. Grease monkey. <laughs> I'm gonna start with my eyebrows. Her eyebrows do this, right? So I'm gonna block off. <laughs> so I'm gonna draw this up and make her long. Great. You know, how the hell? I don't have anything that's like full coverage enough to even try to do this. <laughs> Guess we're gonna go in with this. <laughs> oh. While I'm at it, I'm gonna do this. Cause this is what they do in every single tutorial they do. <laughs> this looks so bad. Should I just shave my eyebrows off? Should I just do that and commit? It doesn't even look that different from my normal eyebrows. Why did I do, I'm wiping it off. All right, let's start again. That looks fine, right? I mean, I wish it did that, but whatever. Now let's snatch the nose. I am going just full glam today. We're not holding back, people. What am I doing? Guess who's looking at me again? My neighbors. Hey, how y'all doing? Hey, how y'all doing? Hey. Hey. Okay. I'm gonna try to shape like the rest of my face under my cheekbone. At what point do you start getting Botox? Should I now? Dolly Parton's what, 70 something? For all the work she's had done, I think she looks great. I wanna look just like her. Dolly Parton simply in the 70s was one of the most beautiful women I've ever seen in my whole life. Okay, I wanna talk about this. I wanna talk about performative activism by celebrities and how it's not a new thing. They've been doing it for forever. I mean, even back to like the, we are the world, we are the children, with like Celine Dion and Michael Jackson, remember that from like the 90s? This shit about like, I take responsibility. I take responsibility. I take responsibility. Every blatant injustice, no matter how big or small, what is that doing for anyone? Girl, we know that these mega billionaires are racist. We know that. You live in a racist system that has benefited you. So why would you ever speak up about it? And the fact that now they're like, I take with shut up. Shoit weep. Okay, so let's, let's look at this picture. I've got a pretty natural contour to my face. Thank God. And I'm gonna go, I'm gonna put it on my cheek instead of under. Let's see. Is that the secret? 
Is that the secret? I bought these earrings on Etsy because they have little skulls dangling. Because I wanted to be Keith Richards. I want to be Keith Richards in every aspect, just minus the heroin. I want to start making music, but I don't want to be like a, no hate, but like a Jacob Sartorius, Lauren Gray type. Lauren Gray is one of the sweetest people I've ever met in my whole life. But it's just like that mentality of like, I mean, God, I have a couple million followers. Let's start making music. It's like, what if we didn't? What if, no, 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 like I hear you, but what if we went back and what if you didn't do that? I, I can't, I'm not blind to the fact that I'm ee, ooh, wee, 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 <laughs> on the internet. And if I were to be like, English, Irish, oh, on Spotify, <laughs> it's like that doesn't, that doesn't make sense. Make it make sense. I want her, her cheekbones look like two hot dog buns. <laughs> they look like hot dog buns. I want to look like a, I want to look like a sexy hot dog bun. Oh my God, it's all I want. What's the best way to go in here? And I try not to get political in here, but like, I feel like that really needed to be said. I'm gonna do a ponytail. I'm gonna do a ponytail, so I need to, <laughs> my hairline. If I were just doing my normal makeup, I would do a little right here to make me look like I've been at the beach. At the each, each. Let's go to the each, each. Minky Minjaj. All right, let's go to the beach, beach. Minky Minjaj. I wish my forehead wasn't as big as it is, but honestly, it gave me a personality, so. Thank you, forehead. If I was 105 pounds, a small forehead, a little bit bigger lips, and then just like generally the rest of my face structure, I would be unstoppable. I would literally be unstoppable. And God was like, we have to humble her. And humble me he did. I'm gonna go in with this orange one in the middle, just like very lightly. Okay, so I didn't go in lightly because I have the Jenna Marbles jean and that's okay. Let's get into this eye, girl. So I have a couple palettes and I'm, I'm kind of sticking with this brown red moment. So I think I'm gonna mix, if you can even see, I'm gonna mix these three, three. Her eyes literally go up like this. <laughs> I literally cannot believe TikTok was almost gone today. I would have lost my damn mind. Okay, so this is kind of like a, it's like a coppery look actually. So I'm gonna go in with this all over my lid. So let's get a different brush. Let's get a different brush. Yeah, do you guys ever play 20 questions with yourself? Well, not 20 questions, but like, if you had to lose any sense, what would it be? I think mine would always be taste. Because I, like if I didn't have music, I, oh my God, if I didn't have music, if I couldn't see, if I couldn't hear, like taste, food is great, but like, if I couldn't taste food, I'd lose so much weight. Like if you start to view food as literally just like fuel for your body and not an emotional comfort response. Put a finger down if you have a really unhealthy attachment and relationship with food. Okay, now let's blend her out, boys. Oh, work. Okay, now I'm gonna add this coppery color. <laughs> with my fingy. Oh, bitch. Oh, Miss Ma'am. Now I'm adding gold. Oh, bitch, this is gonna serve. I literally just had this epiphany. Like, with when the ponytail is on, this is going to serve. Okay, great. Now I'm going to add, like, a liner almost. Like, yeah, right, do you know what I mean? Like, a liner. This dark brown, I think. La, 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 la. Sometimes I feel like Mort from Madagascar. Girl, I'm about sick of FaceTime. In this damn quarantine, everybody want FaceTime. I mean, you, you sit on FaceTime for seven hours. Ma'am, I have better things to do, like be on TikTok. Let's add some mascara and um, lashes. Okay, let's add mascara, mascara, mascara. Does she have bottom lashes on? No, not at all. Remember when I said this was gonna be a dewy look? What am I doing? I'm doing this. I'm gonna do that TikTok hack that's like you put it higher up 
And then you fill it in with black. <sighs> My mind. Okay, and put it up. Guess who I'm still simping for? You guessed it. Jack Harlow. God, that man. Something about him. I don't know what it is. Oh, I just poked myself so hard. Okay, let's fill it in with black. Let's try it with something darker. This is simply the best. This is my secret. It's NYX Matte Liquid Liner. There we go, NYX. This stays on the longest. It doesn't bleed, it doesn't smudge. Okay, that's as good as that's gonna get. In a veil and a mold like a dime. In the fettuccine of Oh, that's it. If my brows just did that, this would be the look. I've seen those hacks where you do that, but if I do that, I will rip out my hair because my hair is so thin. I wanna, I wanna darken everything. I'm not satisfied. Never be satisfied. Now let's do the ponytail. Let's get the reference picture. So the bangs are parted and swooped like that. Great. So let's section these off. And it's a high pony, so let's just go for it, I guess. So my hair is super ass thin, like so thin. So I'm gonna use this and she like wraps her little hair, you see the picture. I'm going to wrap it around this so it makes it look th bigger. I don't know what I'm doing. Yes, yes. Oh my God, am I gonna eat this? Hold on, am I gonna eat this look? Calm down. She's like parted this in two and this side goes under. I used to curl my hair with a straightener every single day in eighth grade. So let's see if I remember how to do this. <laughs> I'm telling you, I'm a beauty guru. Let's do the other side. The cheetah's kind of a moment, no. We're gonna do it her way, we're gonna do it Miss Bella's way. Serving it up Bella's way. Oh, Miss Girl, we're gonna finesse this. Me and my six pieces of hair. Yes! <gasps> That's it. The formula, the formula. Oh my God, did I eat this? And that is the final look. Let's spray. I'm a beauty queen. I am. For anyone who's ever said that I'm not Bella Hadid and who's ever, ever preyed on my downfall, <laughs> how my ass tastes, baby. How my ass tastes. <laughs> I'm feeling this fantasy. What should I wear? What should I change into? I think she's wearing nude. Let's wear something new. I just come back naked. No, like, are you actually kidding? In the picture, she has gold hoops on, but... <sighs> no, I'll do it. For one night, and one night only, Donna and the Dynamos. Okay, folks, there it is. This is my Bella Hadid inspired um, recreation featuring my sunburnt neck and this top that doesn't fit. If you enjoyed, please subscribe. I need to buy groceries with my YouTube money, so. Oh my God, the finishing touch. Yves Saint Laurent. Yves, Yves, see? Yves Saint Laurent. Black opium. Scream again. Oh girl, this is it. I'm feeling my fantasy, feeling my oats, feeling this. The kid screaming in the background just really, really makes that. Okay, um, that's all for this week. Next week I'm gonna be, I don't know. Thanks guys. Bye.